Egg Mountain Key State Park is just one of those places here in the Tampa Bay area that you need to visit. Plus, this year it's on the Hillsborough County hiking spree. If you haven't been before and you don't want to go alone, I've got some great news for you. I am bringing a small group here in January. Here's what to expect. Getting to this secluded island at the mouth of Tampa Bay is part of the fun. Hop on the Hubbard's Marina Egmont Key Ferry from Fort DeSoto's boat ramp. The ride is about 40 minutes, but it sure doesn't feel like it. Enjoy the views of Shell Key, the open water, and just relax. You can purchase some snacks and drinks aboard, so do that or definitely bring your own because there are no businesses on Egmont Key. By the way, there are no bathrooms either, so make sure to go before you leave the dock. The Egmont Key Lighthouse greets you as soon as as you arrive. It was reconstructed here in 1858 to quote withstand any storm. The public is not allowed to go up into the lighthouse, but I'm sure the views are incredible. Today we're doing the Hillsborough County Hiking Spree's designated lighthouse trail and then some. We're going to start in the northwest corner of the island and head south. This is where you'll find the gun batteries. Battery Melon, in my opinion, is the most scenic. Wander around, go inside, and even on top of some of the ruins there. Soak in the sweeping views of the Gulf and the beaches in the distance. Now head south to the historic brick roads. Exploring Fort Dade is one of my favorite parts of visiting Egmont Key because you can stop and take a look at the plaques and see about some of the buildings that once stood here. Fort Dade was established on Egmont Key in 1898 in an effort to protect the Tampa Bay area from the Spanish-American War. 300 people once called the island home. In fact, there was a hospital, jail, movie theater, bowling alley, and tennis courts. You can still see a little bit of what's left today. Just kind of use your imagination. And a trip to Egmont Key would not be complete of course without seeing the beaches. The east side of the island has great views of the Sunshine Skyway and on the west side enjoy the Gulf of Mexico for as far as the eye can see. Comment below and let me know if you have plans to visit for the Hillsborough County hiking spree and if you're interested in going with a small group become a sarahswalkingclub.com subscriber. Sign up now space is limited. You will not regret taking a trip to Egmont Key that I can guarantee. I gotta go catch the ferry now.